Hello everybody and welcome back to Mighty Weeby Plays Rope Universe Alts 4 where we have a colonial nation apparently that just formed to make Russian Australia. So this shall be our colonial nation now. And as we colonize more, uh, more we shall actually just give them. So what ideas do they have? Expansion. Okay, a lot of good ones. Good because now they can colonize for me. Or and for themselves, I guess. By the way. So and all these out whoever they were. Not these guys. And they black flag themselves, good. Love to see that. Minus twenty prestige. That nah. Nah. Okay, let's see then. What do I want? I want to do that, but it will be ready in two months. So I gotta spend, once again, more development. This game, I feel like, is at the end when it's all laggy and stuff, it's just not representing a good title. Like the camera shifts and it has issues all the time. Just becomes halfway unplayable, unfortunately. Unfortunate thing to say because I really do enjoy this game. It's one of my all time favorite games. Just as unfortunate when that happens like that. Okay, so we'll take all of our technology right now. So we just gotta let our armies recover a little bit before we should do a battle or anything. I'm sure we're ticking up quite a bit of war exhaustion. Yep, quite a bit. Just because we have territory that's sieged. Mostly because I didn't think that they'd outrun the fort and then all of a sudden the game lagged and I couldn't pause it until after the end of the month. Otherwise we would have been able to save it. I don't know, honestly this game becomes almost unplayable by the end and it's not I know what you guys might think, it's your system. My system is actually overqualified for this game by quite a bit, and it's not because I'm recording, because everybody has this issue I've checked. It cost quite a bit in order to get you. Well, let's conquer those two things back. I, mean, I guess you get like level one port. Oh, you got a level six. Level six. Okay, so the AI did upgrade their forts this time. So that means that if I could go into the siege them, it'll now be a pain. So I'm guessing they're gonna peace out pretty quick. Because they got most of Jupiter sieged. It's a level 2 fort. Yeah, why don't you go siege that? If you don't mind.
any time now. This game just... I don't know how fast things used to be, but now it all lags. Turn on all that because I don't want to deal with it. And then, I mean, like, look on the other end, though, too. This level 2 fort will almost immediately fall. Yep, 14%. And then Bengal is going to conquer most of that land, too. No, oh, no. Honestly, because of this lag, I'm, I'm really contemplating, and I'm guessing that this is probably gonna be the last episode of the series I'm gonna post. Just because the game has been lagging, it's almost unplayable. It's become unfun for me just based on the lag, unfortunately. And this is just a problem with the game's engine and coding in general, so it's not something fixable, unfortunately. So once we reach the end of this episode, that will be the end of the series. It's unfortunate, I wish I could continue, I love this game so much. Just that it is unplayable at this point. The lag makes it to where you can't interact with anything on time. There's just constant delay and you can't do anything. It just makes it unfortunately unplayable. Yeah, they're doing a whole line, I get it. Hopefully since I gave them their last fort of Juniper, they would surrender, I would have hoped. Our population's okay. I guess it doesn't matter too much, though. I guess I'll just buy down my war exhaustion and hope that they surrender. Just trying to get a crazy stack. This war wouldn't have been a problem had their morale not just been extremely high. I guess I'm gonna go crush their army. Just so I can get. It's gonna take them so long to get there though. Would have been nice if they just had done it while they were right there, but. I gotta try to siege my fort, which they gotta breach the walls right away, of course. Still gonna be a pain though. Bengals actually not doing too bad on this one. Okay, so another one of my colonies apparently got done, but it didn't notify me on that. I guess because it goes straight to my...
my colonial nation now. That's cool, I guess. Make them more powerful. It would have been nice if we could have experimented with them more, but... The game, like I said, has just essentially gotten to the point of being unplayable. It's unfortunate, but it's just the truth. As I'm clicking these notifications, it just doesn't go through. I will replace this series, don't worry about it. There won't just be a day where there's not something going on. Just that, unfortunately, the game has just become unplayable. Like, I really stuck it out there to finish the pull in the one. Which I did, but... I don't know, the game just lags far too much at this point in time. And it's just a game engine problem that Europa has always had. Is it can't calculate the number of entities on the map moving with the AI. With Commonwealth being at war with Persia, that should help in this war a little bit faster. And I'll transfer that to you. I swear, if all they wanted was like this land before they pieced out and they didn't do it themselves, that's gonna be sad. No, I had this guy and then do that. And they're lovely, there's a call for peace. Because they're still in the war for whatever reason. I mean, we have 73% war score. So you'd figure that they would opt out of the war. So another colony has become self sustaining, apparently. Now it gives us 6 prestige for whatever reason. Other than I'm guessing that since I gave it to my colonial nation as default. Which one was it? Was it you? No, it was you. And your coil is off. I don't e it doesn't even matter necessarily that I'm sending people places, but I don't know, I figure you might as well, if you're going to do something, do it well. Tiny little Iraq there. Not the most uncommon thing that happens in this game. 76% war score now, with Juniper being totally sieged. 20 war exhaustion, 100% blockaded. And there we go. And they ate all the land I did there. And they released this nation. Actually, they released all this nation, including that little piece. And that little nation. Pretty sure they released these two as well. That's different. Well, on that note, I guess we'll call this series here. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next episode. Bye, everybody. Thanks for watching.